to Stickers and Tiger Poster with your order. Call 1-800-441-2400. You must be 18 years or older to call. Oh, not tonight, sweetie. You've had Chef every night this week. But I love Chef. Boy, this stuff is good. I'm working for an hourly wage. I went to high school, didn't do great. Still, I gotta make more cash. More education is what I'm looking at. When I get a degree, I will make a bigger salary. So now I've got to see which college is right for me. Say hello to the pillow pets. Pillow pets are cute, huggable pets that pop open into full size pillows. They're soft, they're cuddly, and they make perfect pillows. Moms, your kids will absolutely love their pillow pets. You simply undo the hook and loop strap and the pet pops open into a full size pillow. Just fold it up, reattach the hook and loop, and it's back to a cuddly animal. It's fun and easy. Playtime, sleep time, anytime. Kids of all ages love their pillow pets. There's a panda bear, a ladybug, a frog, a dog, a unicorn, a dolphin, a bumblebee, a monkey, and so many more. Everyone needs a pillow. Why not have a fun pillow? Pillow pets are great for travel. Look, PJs fit right inside. Perfect for the overnight trips to Grandma's house. This is more than just another stuffed animal. This is a pillow that your child or grandchild will use every night. It's a pet with a purpose. Every pillow pet is made of ultra-soft, high-quality chenille fabric. The heavy-duty stitch ensures years of enjoyment and they're even machine washable pillow pets are so soft and huggable all it takes is one hug and your child or grandchild will fall in love with their pillow pet over a million kids are already enjoying their very own pillow pets every pillow pet is so cute and unique the hardest part is choosing which one to get go online to www.pillowpets.com to see the full selection of pillow pets if you have a birthday holiday or special occasion coming up pillow pets make the perfect twenty dollar gift imagine your child or grandchild's face when they get their pillow pet pillow pets come with a full 60 day money back guarantee so go online right now to www.pillowpets.com that's www www.pillowpets.com Adopt your pillow pet today. Here they come, screaming across the sky. It's lots and lots of jets and planes. The greatest collection of aviation DVDs we've ever offered. And through this special TV offer, you can get two DVDs for the price of one. You'll get to see big planes, little planes, soaring stunts and passenger planes, even planes that fly real low. All planes.
New planes, fast planes, slow planes, smoking planes, even planes at supersonic speeds, plus much, much more when you order lots and lots of jets and planes. Each DVD is jam-packed with lots of high-flying close-up action. This special TV offer is not available in stores. Remember, you can get two DVDs, over two hours of non-stop aviation action for the price of one. It's lots and lots of jets and planes. You can order now and receive a free bonus CD of jet plane songs. You must be 18 years old or to call 888-300-3455. Parents, call 888-300-3455. Satisfaction guaranteed. That's 888-300-3455 for lots of jets and planes. It's the Scooby-Doo Haunted House Game. Spin the spinner and move through the house with secret booby traps. Shaggy's been trapped. Watch out, Daphne. Good job, Scooby. Let's see who the ghost really is. The Scooby-Doo Haunted House Game. From the prehistoric past and the limitless future comes Roboraptor. Fluid biomechanical motion and three programmable behavior modes make him interactive, responsive, or unpredictable. Touch sensors in his head and tail make him powerfully interactive. Sonic sensors lock onto sound. Vision sensors see you. Take control of Roboraptor with a multifunction remote or let him roam free. Sensory awareness lets him feel and react with his environment. Friend or predator, you decide. Roboraptor, a fusion of technology and personality. Batteries not included from Huawei. Unleash the power of Roboreptile. Fiercely autonomous, Roboreptile claims his territory, stalking his prey with biomorphic bursts of speed, while his highly evolved vision system alerts him to danger. Part reptile, part technology, all added to Roboreptile. Trigger his sound sensors to lure him in and take command with the remote control. Feeding Roboreptile will tame him, but not for long. Robo Reptile, a fusion of technology and personality. Batteries not included from Wowee. We're back. I got your toothpaste. Or no train toothpaste. <laughs> Very good. Mommy thinks so too. Or gel, safe to swallow, fluoride free, and has great flavors. Mm, that's fun. Or gel, what moms want and kids love. Nerf. New from Nerf. The N Strike Recon CS6. The blaster you can customize for any mission. For night missions, equip the red spy light to spot hidden targets. For multi target missions, the six dark quick fire clip gives you extra firepower. And for long range missions, clip up the sight to nail your target. The N Strike Recon CS6. Only from Nerf. Blaster comes as shown, other blasters sold separately. Batteries not included. Yeah, well, I'm the doodle bear. I come with pens for writing on. Notes and names and games, friends share and pass me on. When they ask me which tattoo I love the best, I throw open my arms. It's rosy on my chest, cause I'm the doodle bear. The original doodle bear. I love to doodle and doodle and doodle. When there's no room for something new, I hop in that washing machine and come out nice and clean, cause I'm the doodle bear. Doodle bear comes in one of four different colors with washable doodle pens and tattoos. Each bear sold separately. Show me a dance. Hey, Furby! Do? Tell me a joke. Knock, knock. Hey, Furby! What? Sing me a song. Me, no. Listen. With hey. new Furby, Ooh, not. you never know what's gonna happen. You just gotta say... Hey, Furby! I love you. New Furby, each sold separately. Batteries not included. You can find more fun at Hasbro.com. Ask a parent first. Pokemon Ruby and Pokemon Sapphire. Only for Game Boy Advance. Rated E for everyone. Wow! Muzzy's programs have been helping children learn languages for 20 years. Hola. Quit him. Hi, I'm David Ward. Muzzy is the number one language course for children in the world. Asua! Sora! There's never been a better time than right now to try Muzzy. To celebrate our anniversary, we'll send you all five original Muzzy languages in one program. And you can try Muzzy free. Love to friend. For the first time ever, five languages, Spanish, French, Italian, German, and English in one program at no extra cost. This is the biggest, most powerful Muzzy ever. Remember, kids are open to languages. It comes naturally. They don't see it as work. It's 
fun, and it all just happens. Kids love Muzzy, and with five languages in one, try Muzzy free. What are you waiting for? Why spend a fortune for beautiful decorated cakes like these? Now you can decorate them yourself with a little help from Betty Crocker. Introducing the Betty Crocker 100-piece cake decorating kit. It's everything you need to create beautifully decorated cakes and desserts just like a professional. The secret is this unique multi-directional applicator. All you do is point and squeeze. Simply insert a disposable bag, fill it with icing, and attach the nozzle. Then select a tip you want to use. Choose the flower tip to cover your cake with beautiful flowers like this. The star tip to make striking shell borders or braided ropes. Or the petal tip to create elegant roses. Imagine being able to create gorgeous accents like this. It's so easy you can make these accents with one hand. There's even a grass hair tip for unusual novelty cakes. The three-profile icing knife can be used to sculpt, smooth, or create special effects. And your complete decorating kit even includes letter stencils for that special message and a set of pattern presses for heartfelt designs. Imagine creating these one-of-a-kind homemade cakes all by yourself. You can order and receive the Betty Crocker 100-piece decorating kit with everything you see here, plus an easy-to-use instruction guide and a handy storage case to hold everything, all for $10 plus shipping and handling. You must be 18 or older to order. Guaranteed to delight you or your money back. That's right. This offer from Betty Crocker turns ordinary baking into an extraordinary event. The Betty Crocker 100-piece cake decorating kit makes a great gift for those who love to bake. Here's how to order. To order your Betty Crocker 100-piece decorating kit for $10 plus shipping and handling, you can call 1-800-909-6538 or send check or money order to Betty Crocker 100-piece decorating kit to Morgan Avenue, Norwalk, Connecticut, 06851. 1-800-909-6538. You must be 18 years or older to order. Is your dessert so boring it's left your family snoring? Not anymore. Introducing the original Chocolate Factory, the fun, easy way to turn ordinary into extraordinary desserts. Just place in store-bought chocolate, select your favorite treat, then with adult supervision, simply dip it, dunk it, fill it, or pour it. Look, regular pots burn chocolate, but Chocolate Factory's double boiler is two pans in one. The bottom simmers water, while the top quickly melts chocolate into a smooth and creamy sensation. Perfect for dipping nuts, strawberries, and bananas. And look, fill the designer mold for snowmen during the holidays. Create teddy bears, seashells, lollipops, and more. You can even make a gift basket at a fraction of the price. The complete chocolate factory kit comes with everything you need, including this dipping dessert guide. That's over 90 pieces, all for $19.95. Here's how to order. Call 1-800-592-3388 and order the Chocolate Factory for $19.95. Treat your family to chocolate creations. You must be 18 or older to call. Tricks, get your tricks! Tricks? A fruit delicious part of this complete breakfast! Bursting with the sweet, fruity taste! You can see! <gasps> Grapeity purple, blind green! I gotta tackle those tricks! <laughs> My eyes are playing tricks. Tricks? It's a tricks bowl. And it'll bowl you over. But silly rabbit tricks are for kids. Color changing trick shaped water squirters. Now there's one free in Mark Alright, 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 alright. Too late, play. What was I gonna say? Uh... <laughs> I have no idea. Shit. Happy Mother's Day! Oh shit, I forgot about that. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. I heard you wanted a new type of sandwich. Yeah, I wanted I don't know, maybe like a sandwich with like some avocado in it and stuff like that. And like something also like kind of sweet and stuff like, I don't know, um, like peanut butter or jelly and stuff like that. So but anyways, how's it going everybody? Oh shit, I forgot my hat. Alright, there we go. So like... There we go. Put on my trademark hat and stuff, so like... But how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Video Game Fight Club, the only Twitch stream where, uh... <laughs> where we, uh, whatchamacallit? So, like, reject authority. It's a... Like, against... We we are against all authority. It's up our mothers and stuff like that, so... Well, my name is Pandar, formerly known as Rudy Alshi, and I approve this message. How's everybody doing? How are you doing, Zen? So, yeah, no. Um... Apparently today, damn, 
Today was supposed to be like a Mother's Day celebration with my family and stuff. And, uh, yeah, no, and I was just like, I told my grandma, I was just like, dude, I'm gonna go after work and stuff, which is like after five and or anything like that. And then I went, well, I went to like my house first to go pick up like my grandma's, um, like my grandma's Mother's Day present and stuff, dude. And, uh, I get to like my grandma's house and no one's there. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, my grandma's was there and stuff, but there was no party, no nothing, so it's a little weird. So, a knuckle sandwich with avocado, that's what you get. So, like, you know, I've actually eaten something like that before. Like, yeah, it just reminded me. <laughs> I remember a co worker of mine, like an old co worker, she was just like, hey, my grandma, my grandma, my mom made this sandwich with jelly and avocado and stuff like that so like you want to give it a try and like i i was peer pressured into trying it out and stuff like that i was just like what the hell <laughs> oh man it was not that great so like exhausted word for sure well i hope you have like a restful day soon and stuff man like i know you've been like working pretty hard and doing Finals. Are you done with finals, by the way? My brother is, like, currently doing finals and stuff, so, like, apparently it's just, like, last week and everything, which is crazy to me. That's so sad. What? So, like, yeah. Jelly and avocado sounds terrifying, so, like, you should try it, man. You should you should do a reaction video. <laughs> just eating, like, a jelly sandwich with uh, avocado and stuff like that, you know? Oh yeah, I'm done with finals. I finished last week. Oh dude, hell yeah! Well, I hope you did great and stuff. Uh, I hope you passed. I hope um, your professors look at your work and are like, Oh damn, this... Yo, this is like some of the best work I've ever seen. <laughs> I did good, hell yeah! Oh fuck, hold on. Wait, give me a second. So, I forgot to turn this on. I was about to like hit the, hit the hotkey and stuff without... Yeah, see, that's what was gonna happen. No, you're doing the wrong sound effect. Okay, 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 okay. Give me a second. Okay. Jeez! <laughs> oh my god. Anyways, um. Also, why did this move all of a sudden? Push notifications. Okay, hold on. I just realized something. This is super really weird. It's bugging me. It's bugging me, dude. There we go. There we go. That's way better. Okay, there we go. It wasn't. I don't know. I just worked show call for a huge festival in my area. Up at 4 a.m. in the past three days, and I had an event Friday night and last night, so a little sleep. I go in later tomorrow, though, for strike. Uh, I got a. I got to see a lot of cool bands. Ooh, nice, dude. So. For strike? What does that mean? Wait, are you actually going on strike for work? Oh man. <laughs> well. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's what it means, right? But no, what bands did you see, anyways? Like, striking stages and concerts, etc. Oh, okay. My bad, my bad. Okay, no worries. I was just like, uh, what? <laughs> okay, all right, all right. Thank you. Noted. <laughs> I'm like, oh no, that sounds. Uh... <laughs> okay, cool, cool, cool. Well, uh, I got to hear the sound check for Vampire Weekend in uh, LCD. Whoa, really? That's hype, dude. Like. 
Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's fair. <laughs> no, yeah. I don't want to talk about it, but like... My... My workplace slash union kind of talking about something like that, and I'm like, oh god. <laughs> oh, let's leave it at that and stuff, so... There are a lot. I got a couple videos on my view, so like, dude, that's fucking rad, hell yeah! Well, I hope you had fun. Like, I know it was probably exhausting and stuff. But yeah, I hope you had fun, dude. So... Oh no, yeah. Right, right. <laughs> yeah. But we're not there yet and stuff. I hope we don't get there and stuff. So, uh, what else did I do today? Yeah, I just saw my grandma. My grandma's doing great and stuff. And I left the Kirby heads with like my brothers and stuff like that. Like I printed another Kirby head and stuff. Because I thought I was going to see Sleepy Kirby today and stuff. Like over at like my family's like Mother's Day thing. But no, like it seemed like everybody left early and stuff. So, I'm kind of sad. I'm just like, fuck. <laughs> oh man, dude. So like, but shit, I'll print. So like, yeah, I'll just print another like Dwayne the, the Dwayne the Rock Kirby. <laughs> oh man. Anyways, like, what was I going to say? So like, yeah, I think we should play some of the video games. What are we doing today and stuff? So I guess we're going to continue playing another Crab's Treasure and stuff like that. We're playing this on Game Pass and stuff, and I'm not gonna lie to you, like, recently it was in, like, the news that, like, Xbox shut down Tango Game Works and, uh, like, Arcane Austin and stuff like that. They, like, shut down some studios and stuff. I'm kinda iffy, like, on, like, playing some, or, like, paying for, like, Game Pass anymore, at least for a while. I'm like, ah, damn, I don't wanna feel cool with this. <laughs> oh, boy. Um... But I don't know. I don't know how I'm, like, like, what was I gonna say? So like, what I'm trying to say is, we're definitely gonna play another Crab's Treasure today and stuff like that, in the coming weeks, hopefully. But once my Game Pass expires, I'm not gonna re resubscribe. I don't know. At least not for a while because I'm like kind of like salty about that. I'm just like, damn. I can't believe they closed down like a a game studio then. Okay, fuck. I don't know what just happened right now. Yo, what up? <laughs> DJ, why did you activate my lag switch, dude? Like, that's fucked up. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> I got disconnected right now from OBS for some reason. I don't know. I've been noticing that like I've been watching like some YouTube videos and stuff and it's been like stuttering a little bit and stuff. So like it's weird. So well, what's up DJ? How's it going? How are you doing? I don't know primo. What's the matter? <laughs> How are you doing safe? Sorry for that dog. So so it was you. You were the one with the lag switch dude. So like Oh, that's all. Hey, Safe. Yeah, but how are you? How are... Safe, how are you doing? DJ, how are you doing? <laughs> I joined to watch and you left. <laughs> the AI has detected anime and stuff, like, in on stream. So it's it's just auto shuts down, dude. Like... <laughs> no, I don't know what happened. I think that was just like a hiccup or whatever on my internet. I hope it doesn't happen again and stuff. So, like... But we'll see, we'll see. But, no, yeah, we were just talking about, like, how Microsoft shut down Tango Game Studio, Tango Game Studio, and Austin Arcade, and other, like, um, development studios, and, uh, it's crazy, it's wild to me to hear that, especially since, I don't know, we were talking about Hi-Fi Rush, like, I, I don't know, I was saying how cool and unique that game was and stuff. Um, and they closed down the studio after like a successful game and stuff like that. And like, I don't know. I'm just, I just feel weird playing Game Pass stuff and anything. <laughs> that's that's where we kind of left it off and anything. So, yeah, F anime. It's the worst. Yeah, I know. Like anime. Poo poo caca poo poo. 
Dude, I hate this Twitch mobile update that puts on that puts you on some TikTok screen. So like, wait, really? Is it like on the side or whatever like that? Or is it like the stories shit and stuff like that? Yeah, like, it's kind of weird. Like these recent like Twitch mobile updates and everything. They're kind of strange, <laughs> you know? Raise his hand straight up. Everyone give me your energy. Hey, 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 I got some pliers right here. Don't make me use them and stuff, okay? Like, <laughs> um, when you open Twitch, it auto plays a stream or story. You have to click following to actually find streams. Really? Holy shit. Maybe I haven't updated my crap and stuff. So, like, uh, yeah, that's fucking weird. Okay, my hands are up. So, uh, yeah, 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 put them up, put them up. This isn't. Wait, wait a second. Put them down. <laughs> oh my god. On Android, at least, for show, for show. That's so fucking weird. Uh, yeah, I sometimes. I'm really lazy on updating, like, my apps and my phone and stuff. I know I should probably be doing that for security purposes and stuff, but. Sometimes I'm just like that, like new update, new software update for iOS, and I'm just like, oh, not right now. I'm like watching some funny videos, dude. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know about I've been pwn uh, user, so like word. I haven't gotten that update yet, but it sounds like crap. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fuck that. That sucks. So like I hope they revert it back and stuff like that then DJ. So yeah. But anyways, um What were we talking about again? Oh yeah, what were we doing? We're playing another crab's treasure and stuff, so um I'm excited bike to to play this. Uh but yeah, I guess what are we doing this week and anything? Um DJ, did you wanna like play content warning this week and stuff? Uh because okay, so um so Wednesday, I think I am going to be playing with my brothers again and stuff like that. So I'm going to see if we can play Monster Hunter, but like my brother wants to play Overwatch, which I'm not too excited to play. <laughs> but, but yeah, I definitely do want to like play with my brothers on Wednesday, but like I'm definitely down to play on Thursday if that's um, yeah, if that's something y'all want to do and stuff like that. Like Zen, are you available on Thursday? You want to play some video games? <clears throat> uh, I haven't gotten that update, but oh, wait, I already wrote that. <laughs> the I am pwn. So, uh, oh, I get you. I get you. The <laughs> content warning will be sick. I'm down to play on Thursday then, so if you're down, so like. Uh, I can probably like stream a little earlier than that and stuff and yeah so that, that would be kind of our week and stuff so because i do want to like continue playing with my brothers again and stuff it's it's fun to like play with them and everything so uh but yeah i guess that's like kind of like my stream schedule like for now so today we're gonna be doing another crab's treasure we're gonna continue that we're gonna continue playing that game until either we beat it or our Game Pass subscription expires and stuff like that. Yes, I said it here. I'm not resubscribing to Game Pass, at least for a while and stuff like that. I'm actually kind of salty that they like um, closed down Tango Game Studio and stuff like that. So like, and you know what? I'm completely fine with that. So. <laughs> and then uh, tomorrow, tomorrow we'll play. We were playing Dino Crisis, but we beat that and stuff. So I'm so happy we beat that. Like, fuck that game. Um, I said we were gonna play this game called um, uh, Tales of Kenzera Zao and stuff. I actually bought that game like uh, a week ago or two weeks ago. I haven't played it. I only benchmarked it a little bit and stuff to see it, how it runs and stuff, and it runs pretty well. Uh, I'm excited to play that. It's kind of like a it's another metroidvania and everything so like um what else tuesday more kingdom hearts wednesday monster hunter and maybe some overwatch i don't know we'll see uh and then thursday we'll play some content for it and stuff so 
I tried to sharpen that joke up, but you can't polish turds like <laughs> I disagree. I polished many turds and sold them on like jewelry stores, stores and stuff like that. You you'd be surprised. People would buy crap anywhere. <laughs> Good, fuck them. <laughs> right? I don't know. So uh, yeah. You're would you say you're gonna damn <laughs> Man. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to use this now, dude. I, I have these pliers right here. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. That was a really good one. <laughs> I'm gonna have to ask you to leave, so like <laughs> anyways, let's start this game now. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> okay, this game is like starting now. Alright. Made with Unity. Alright, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna continue this. Another crab's treasure. Agro crab. There we go. <clears throat> hey, cool. I guess they could, like finally fixed the button thing. Ah! Right. Two. You run with this, you jump. I guess to I had to, I guess if it was capitalized or not, so like <laughs> no, that was a good one. Good luck, Mr. Crab's treasure. So like yes, yes. Mr. Krabs is back. Hi, uh, my name's Krill. Do you know of anything shiny in this cave? Something that might impress like a huge beautiful crab lady. Confused and desperate, the hermit crab begins begging for help from strangers. Hey, I'm not desperate. Yet. Thus far, he has preserved by taking refuge in artifacts from beyond the waves. But to survive from here on out, he must awaken the currents inside of him. He must access the power of Umami. Umami? Look, if there's some secret I should know about, can you please just tell me what it is? Stuff's been convoluted, convoluted enough ever since I left the Tide Pod. Feeling pity for the helpless creature? The normal moon snail design dines to awaken his latent abilities manually. You better not be messing with me. Whoa. What the shell was that? I feel tingly. The hermit crab dons a metal shell and feels a new ability awaken. I do? Yes, he does. Umami training. Shell spells. While wearing a shell, press uh, square to consume umami charges and activate its unique spell shell. Use umami charges will regenerate slowly when you attack enemies with your fork. While wearing a shell. Okay. Shell shock. A creature blocks the hermit crab's path. Immune to his physical attacks, it may only be dispatched by his powerful new mummy powers. Well, isn't that convenient? The noble snail, moon snail, denies any involvement in manufacturing this scenario. The once innocent hermit crab ability to slaughter his enemies has increased dramatically. Did you have to put it that way? 
He senses that the reward he seeks lies further within this cavern. As well as the opportunity to meet his newfound idol, the mysterious and attractive moon cell in the flesh. Guess I got no choice. Hop off. Ah! Oh, wait, no, I see where to go. Red Claw. Good luck, Sebastian. Remember to sing your song. Good night, chat slash panda. Have a wonderful stream. Thanks, Zen. You have a great uh, stream, too, as well. So, uh, I'll see you around. Take good care of yourselves. Hey, yeah, man. Deuces. Take care. I seen this movie before, the part where Dr. Morbius jumps out from behind the kelp during the big boss battle and yells, It's mother effing Morbin time, before taking a bite out of the baguette. He goes crazy, dude. Bro, I love him. Bro. You just, like, spoiled it for everybody. <laughs> What's up, Neuron? How are you doing, by the way? What have you been up to? Sit. Okay, that's weird. You just, like, sit on there, I guess? I don't know how you got the baguette to not get soggy underwater, but the movie... The movie's magic, I guess, dude. Yeah, I... <laughs> The CG is becoming way too real, dude. So, like, <laughs> he fell. What an idiot. I was doing homework like some kind of loser. Who just. What's that? That sounds lame. You should be playing video games. <laughs> no, that's actually cool, dude. So, like, wait, are you. You're legit doing homework, right? That's what's up, dude. Hell yeah. Did you start taking your classes and stuff, dog? No, no. Neuron was working on homework today for his master's in data science. So, like... Oh, you were watching? <laughs> I was going to say, how do you know that? Holy shit. I lurked. Oh, bro. Fuck yeah. <laughs> bro. <laughs> Bro, like, what was that I say? Safe knows his lore, dude. What? I bet you he's one of the the moderators in like the the, the video game Fight Club wiki and stuff, dude. Like, <laughs> I was playing Fortnite and was giving the view, so like, word, hell yeah. <laughs> Thanks for the homie. For the for the lurk, homie. Wait, you were like streaming Neuron? And I didn't even know about that? You didn't tell me? <laughs> Excuse me? What? I wanted to be there. Mother. Oh my god. Where do I do this again? Oh, I'm dead. Do I have to go pick up my dumb shit again and stuff? 
Yeah, I was lol. It got weird because somebody was trying to get at me for using the Latinist tag on my stream. Really? That's fucked up. Man, fuck them then, dude. I don't know. I just feel like when people get mad at that, they're just like being kind of babies and stuff. I'm like, how is this affecting you, dude? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just like, oh shit, I didn't see that. So like. That's fucked up though, like... I've had people like come over to my stream and just comment Latinx? Ha 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 ha! And just like leave or whatever. I'm like, uh, yeah! It was just, it's just been weird. <laughs> I'm like, whatever dude. Whether you agree or not with the term Latinx, you think you just leave people alone, right? Yo, no, yeah, for sure. Like, uh, it's just weird, dude. Oh fuck! Oh, did I die? Where's the music to this game? The music just like... Did I take damage from that? Sure, we'll take that. Surprise strike from your show that launches your enemy in front of you. Release this pressurized air to push away enemies. That fucking killed me, dude. Why? God. This is definitely just like Dark Souls and stuff. So, yeah, how's everybody doing today? <laughs> oh boy, anyways. I'm going this way now. A tiny share snail adheres to the rocks. So strongly there. We're gonna...
shot glass shards. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, hell no. Shit. Oh, fuck. What? Ah, oh, damn. Really? Ugh. the hell is that? <gasps> what the f Bro! I really just lost all my fucking shit because of that? What happened right there? So I didn't die right there? That's weird. I just took damage and everything, so like... So, what's the difference between falling there and, like, in the other locations?
cool. Consume some shell help. A small blast of confetti that deals damage and interrupt enemies. Okay. I'm gonna eat some popcorn chicken and do some reading for my class. Hey, no worries. Yeah, man. Do your thing. Uh, I'm gonna be here if you need me. Oh, shh. Really? They fucking killed me right here, dude. Oh my god. I'm already behind. Hey, no worries, dude. Do your thing, dude. Yeah, no worries. No worries. I'll be here. I'll be here. <laughs> Oh shit, who the fuck is that? Who the fuck is that? I think I know who the fuck. Oh my god. What's up, dog? Hey, bro, are you enjoying your new toy, dude? <laughs> I knew it was broccoli. Who else than broccoli? How are you doing, man? I haven't seen you in like forever, dude. Yeah. Shoot, I'm late. Hi, hey, <laughs> how are you doing, late? What have you been up to? Welcome back. Yo, 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 didn't lose your streak today. <laughs> no, sorry. Oh, man. Well, yeah, I hope you've been doing good, late. Shout out Light Dawnfire, yes. Shout out Light Dawnfire. Hmm. You know what? I think I might just take that because why not? Ugh, I'm gonna have to like fight this fool. Russian attacks. 
The blue aggro symbol lets you know an enemy is about to use a crushing attack. These are powerful blows that are very likely to break your shell if you're hiding in it. When you see it, be sure to dodge, run, or jump out of the way. Dude, I fucking dodged. Oh my god. Bro, oh my god. Dude, fuck you. Oh my god, and then I have to like trail all the way back and stuff. Would you like to respawn at the nearby moon jelly location? Sure. Oh, that's nice enough for the game to do that for me and stuff. What? Okay. Okay. I'll give you that game. <laughs> Okay, that makes me feel way better and stuff. I was just like, damn, dude. I have to go, like, walk all over, like, over here from the beginning and stuff. And make sure I don't die and collect my, my collectibles again and stuff like that, you know? <laughs> You're actually early for tomorrow. That's really funny. <laughs> I'm doing it. I've been uh, replaying uh, Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. It's been fun. Yeah, it's been one year since that game's uh, been released, which is wild to me though <laughs> you know i thought oh man it's funny okay 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 breath of the wild was the next gen zelda and stuff like that and that thing was so many years in the making and stuff like that and then tears of the kingdom was announced i didn't even have a a name or whatever and that was like so many years announced and uh so many years away from release but, but now both of them are released, you know? Like, it's it's weird. <laughs> Anyways, I have that game. I have to play it eventually, too, and stuff like that. Somehow! Oh, my God. Oh, shit. Did I really just die? Tears of the kingdom. Dude, what the fuck? I have to do that like the last second and anything, so...
Change of plans. I need to do uh, essay prevention training. Really? Oh wow. Is that for work? Good luck with that. For school. Oh, okay. Shit. Oh, damn. It's supposed to be an hour long. Hey, no worries then. Go do that, man. Go do that. <laughs> Like, the controls are still kind of weird to me and stuff like that. I'm gonna cheese that right there. A gorgeous pearl manufactured somewhere beyond the ocean. Looks perfect for an impressing royalty. Tell me how your training is going then. <laughs> Moon Snail's Domain. long last, the hermit crab lays eyes on the powerful borderline sensual body of the moon snail. Hi! Thanks for leading me here. I think the Duchess is really gonna like this pearl. But I still need a way to get out of this cave. In order to progress, the hermit crab will need to further expand on his Mwabi abilities. Cool! How do I do that? I'm getting to it, damn. I mean... The hermit crab closes his eyes and allows himself to become one with the waves. He notices the effect his body has on the current around him and lets himself be changed by uh, be changed by them in turn. Okay. Hey, when I close my eyes, I can start to see something. I see a tree, some sort of tree of scales. Oh boy. <laughs> Uh, shell portation allows you to warp between previously visited. Okay. Every single thing leaves current in its wake as it travels through this ocean. Be it a living person, a beast, a corpse, or even a piece of garbage. The life force of the ocean, the beating heart of this world. This phenom phenomenon is known as umami. Invisible to most, umami currents can be detected only by a chosen few. Even fewer still can't make use of them. Oh, the glowing purple stuff? I've seen that surrounding some big shells and crystals out there, so... Surprising. I guess I didn't need to zap you then. I mean, the hermit crab's training may progress faster than anticipated. He feels that perhaps if he enters a discarded moon snail shell, a new use for it might reveal itself. Hmm. 
Release your block uh, the moment an enemy strikes to perform a parry. Your shell won't take damage and your opponent might flinch. Press uh, circle mid jump to gracefully dodge through the water. Oh, that one. Wait, I can't get that one? Hmm, maybe I have to be over there. Oh, so do I have to like come back every time over here to upgrade myself? Interesting. Out in the open ocean, many creatures must take up another bodies in order to survive. The hermit crab has already taken the life of many times already, but as this story escalates, so too must the violence. Hermit crab shell is invaluable in protecting him for predators, but protection will not be enough to achieve his goals. He must make he his shell a tool of aggression. He deflects his enemy's attack, destabilizing and confusing them. How can such a small creature withstand such a massive blow? It seems to defy the natural order. Elusive frame. Become invincible for several seconds. After parrying an enemy, uh, quickly press R1 to perform. After your shell takes a hit while blocking. Hmm. Press L2 to throw your fork at enemies' roof. Barbed hook. Okay, uh, get out of here, I guess. Shell porting. Krill's attainment to Umami will now enable him to warp between any moon snail shells he has previously visited.
The hermit crab knows instinctively to return to his place whenever he faces danger beyond his abilities. While we're at it, can you tell me how taxes work? The hermit crab knows instinctively to stop pushing its luck. Oh, over there. Okay. Fort Slacktide? What happened? I've been standing watch my whole life. For what? Got nothing in return. Stupid, stupid. Hey, excuse me. I gotta get back in to see the Duchess again. It keeps piling up. All the trash. All the work. Are you like, okay, man? sick of it I'm sick to death of all of it it's all so worthless oh great Hi dude, what's up Diamond? How's it going? Welcome back. Sick. <laughs> what have you been up to? <laughs> oh, what the hell? Okay, I'm still on to bed. <laughs> alright, I'm alright. Hanging on, just playing some video games. You know, how's your days been and stuff, Diamond?
Yeah, but yeah, how, how have I been doing? I'm alright, i just been chilling. I went to go see my grandma today because today was Mother's Day and stuff and I thought that was like important and stuff, you know, so like, so I did that. I gave her like a, a nice present and stuff, or I hope she thought it was nice. She told me she liked it. Oh shit! Yo! Oh, yo, you didn't say anything today. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Thanks, man. How are you doing? What was I gonna say? So, like, yeah. So, like, I got her, like, this, like, pot that was made in Mexico and stuff like that. And I got a bunch of, like, um, f like, fake flowers for it, too, and stuff. And uh, one thing I didn't notice about, like, these, like, flowers and stuff. 30 months! God damn, dude! Pedro, 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 Paquita. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, I got you. I got you. Uh, uh. Let me see if I can do this. I'm trying to rotate this. <laughs> I don't know if you can notice. Oh shit. <laughs> okay, that's the best I got. <laughs> I should figure out how to actually do that and just like, you know? Yo, thank you so much for the 30 months, dude. How have you been, Pollo? Like, what have you been up to, dog? I'm so style. It was good. I went to my mom's house and gave her some roses for Mother's Day. We had dinner, so like, oh, that's nice. Oh, yeah. I'm glad you had an excellent Mother's Day and stuff like that. I hope everybody had a wonderful Mother's Day with their mom and stuff like that. Or, like, yeah. So, like, yeah. <laughs> and if not, I hope anybody um, that didn't celebrate today, like, you know, just had a wonderful day, too, as well and stuff. So, uh, what else is I going to say? So, like, yeah, I know. But, like, yeah, I gave, like, my grandma, like, this Mexican pot and everything um, that I bought, like, from this store that has, like, stuff from, like, Mexico and stuff like that. Uh, and I got her some, like, fake flowers with it and stuff like that. And one thing I didn't notice about these flowers and anything that, like, my grandma told me, she was just like, yeah, these, these, like, like, fake flowers are obviously most likely made from Mexico, too, because, like, they use like the leaves and like the the stuff like the the flower part of the the fake flower was actually made from like you know like i guess like the the corn husk or, like you know what they would wrap tamales with and stuff that's what those flowers were made out of and i was just like holy shit i didn't notice that like and yeah that was actually kind of cool that she told me that and stuff like i also like 3d printed something 3d printed uh, something for my grandma and she really liked it I was just like yeah I like so but yeah other than that like um what else was I gonna say so like no no not much I went to work <laughs> thank god I had a bad start with Mother's Day the place I reserved for brunch never came with our food so we left oh man fuck that place dude so like on a Mother's Day and stuff like that that's fucked up I'm sorry dude so I gotta get some sleep now. I gotta go by. Yeah, no worries, Diamond. Mean, thank you so much for like being here. I hope to see you again. Uh, take good care of yourself. And yeah, man. So like, yeah. Thank you. Thank you for being here. So, all right, deuces. Take care. <laughs> but then we went to the movies to watch the new Planet of the Apes movie and got food there. So that was good. So like, dude, hell yeah. Well, that's good. Hell yeah. How was the new Planet of the Apes movies and stuff like that? That's like the fourth one, isn't it? 
I really thought they were gonna like stop or whatever. <laughs> but no, they're, they're, they're going with it. You know what? And I'm all for it. Like those moves are actually pretty entertaining. Surprisingly good. Hell yeah. Dude, I, 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 I don't remember who I saw the second one with and stuff, but I saw the second one. I love the second one and stuff. So like the first one, I've only seen bits and pieces of it and stuff. I've never seen the third one. I don't know anything about the third one. <laughs> I'm actually excited for the next one. Dude, fuck yeah. Yeah, no, they're great movies. Planet of the Apes. I did you know that I played one of the apes in that movie? Fuck. Feather, feather, feather. Damn, dude. Pedro, 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 Pe. Platica me na tanan. Oh my god. Didn't get poison. I came thinking it's gonna be shit or boring, but it was really good. So, like, that's what's up, dude. I'm glad you're. You. Isn't that a great feeling, though? Like. When you expect something that's gonna be like boring or crappy and then you end up loving it instead. <laughs> I'm glad you had fun, dog. Come on. Pedro, Pedro, Pedro. Oh. oh, I finally did it. PlayStation Plus has been canceled, and I think Game Pass is going to be next. Uh, <laughs> bro, you missed it, dude. You totally missed it and stuff. It's hella funny because, like, for me, PlayStation Plus has been canceled for a while and anything. Um, yeah, but I recently reinstated it and stuff, mostly because. Just so I could play video games with my brothers on PlayStation and everything like that. So I have PlayStation Plus Essentials. Like I, I don't really feel like getting the other ones or whatever like that. So, but Game Pass, I still had Game Pass and stuff. And you know, I'm just kind of like salty about like what Microsoft recently did and like closing down Tango GameWorks, which they recent release hi-fi rush and stuff dude you know like and dude like <laughs> bro, didn't, you played that game too right tango gameworks is that yeah that's m fucking mind-blowing <laughs> they also closed on uh arcane austin and stuff like that like and other studios and it's just it's fucking terrible it's just like dude what was the reason for acquiring these studios and stuff like that like what the fuck like, it's just, bruh, like, honestly, I'm like, why? Honestly, it's why I may, I, I want, that's why I want to cancel it. Dude, that's the same reason too and stuff. Like, I'm currently playing this game through, like, Game Pass and stuff like that, but I already told Chad, I was just like, dude, like, either we stop playing this game because we beat it, or, like, my Game Pass subscription expires. <laughs> But I just don't want to like support Microsoft for a while or whatever like that because like that's just fucking shitty, dude Like it blows my mind. What is the fucking point of like? Acquiring Bethesda and then shutting down like Tango and like you you really just want to focus on like Starfield and like Elder Scrolls and stuff like that like I don't know I thought like oh my god Microsoft is like holy shit, dude like after they did that, I was just like, these motherfuckers just want to focus on Call of Duty. Like, I think that's like what they intend on doing and stuff like that. They don't give a fuck about like really making any games or whatever like that. They just want to like, I mean, obviously they're a fucking giant corporation and stuff like that. Like, but oh my gosh, out of protest, I'm with you right there, dude. Like, 
Xbox more like shit box. <laughs> I agree. Like fuck. Like dude, man, and it's unfortunate because I like the Xboxes. I like the 360s, the Xbox ones and oh fuck. And I was honestly thinking about like maybe in the future getting like a uh <laughs> Getting a Series X and stuff like that. What the fuck? Oh man, I wasn't paying attention to that. They've never recovered since 2011 when he announced always online feature for Xbox One. So like, yeah. Yeah. They're still trying to do that and stuff like that. That's why Game Pass exists, you know? Like... They want to make you think that Game Pass is great, which is like, it has its benefits and stuff like that. But in the end of the day, Microsoft is really just trying to go all digital and not have you own anything and stuff, you know, like. They're, they still have that mindset. <laughs> Facts, yeah. Like... I don't know, I'm, I'm fucking... Uh, fuck Microsoft, dude, like, honestly. I cannot believe, dude, like, holy shit. I'm just thinking, I'm like, what the f- Like, are we gonna get another Evil Within, too, and stuff like that? And if they do make another Evil Within, it's gonna be without, like, Tango Gameworks and stuff? That's gonna feel shitty, you know? Like, I don't know. It's just, uh, I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna have to do all these stupid ass fights again, aren't I? I just realized. Damn it, dude. I'm not used to like playing Soulsborne's games and stuff like that. I don't like it when I lose my money and stuff. Boy, well, you're like more used to like Soulsborne's games and stuff like that. Oh, what the? F oh shit! I'm gonna lose my shit. How often do you lose your money in Soulsborne's games? I think I'm free when they're doing their Xbox showcase. So I'm gonna head over with a sign saying, Bring back. <laughs> Yo, you should do that, man. When is that, honestly? That's like in June or something like that, isn't it? Bro, I'll drive down there and just do that with you. I'll go on protest with you. <laughs> Bring back Tango Gameworks. Oh, never because I'm that good, so like. Bro, like, oh my god. I haven't lost my money yet, but like the thought of just like losing like my money is just like, oh god, no, please. Whoa, holy shit. Homeboy dead? Holy sh no, I don't think so. Prime, possession of seaweed. Oh wow. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> Well, we have PC and, uh, PC never fails, I guess. <laughs> it's hella funny. Like, yeah, the PC has definitely been one of my most played systems recently. So, shout out to Neuron, dude. Thanks for hooking it up for the computer and stuff. Hi. 
Oh my god. I don't have any much more life. After a certain point, you just gotta get good and worry less about the money slash souling. More on getting better with the mechanics in combat. For sure, for sure. That makes sense. Wait, what am I supposed to do here now? Alright, noted, noted. I play Kaizo, I think I know what I'm doing. Oh, I'm gonna die, aren't I? Alright, cool. Anemone, an invertebrate that snares tiny prey with its many tentacles. So, loitering. limp it. Oh shit. Oh fuck I forgot I don't have a shell. I can't block. Hey bro, do you have a shell? No shell. No shell for you. Well, looks like we're gonna have to go back to this one right here.
shit. What? <laughs> okay, that's a way of doing that. Oh shit. Rare twice in a month cookie appearance. Hey, what's up? <laughs> that is rare indeed. I must go buy a lottery ticket or something, dude. So, like. How are you doing, cookie? Welcome back. I'm on a ferris wheel of doing good and holy shit my life is falling apart but it isn't even a ferris wheel it's just my imagination because i'm bored so like word word wow shit i'm sorry to hear that ah oh, bitch Yo, is this the Fall Guy story mode? No. <laughs> it's funny though. Oh, huh, interesting. So that didn't open right there or whatnot? So that's the front entrance right there, isn't it? Huh? 
Dog, I don't even know, dude, so. Apparently, I used to be important here, so like. Wait, what do you mean by that? <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, I see, I see, I see, I see. I have the IP. Wait, what? You do? That's interesting. I mean, I'm not complaining. <laughs> what the? Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Oh, I was going the right way. I've been here since Fear Dejashi uh, was an existing name for this channel. So, like, yeah, that's right. How did you find me? Can you remind me of that? I want to say you came from like Young Vango. Jolt from warm beverage that increases attack speed. Hey, I don't know if you noticed, but your guards are going nuts out there. Oh, Clontre, little hermit. <laughs> Our minds are clear as crystal now. Oh, Shuck. I once thought my duchy quite beautiful, you know. Worth preserving, but compared to the reefs, it's a shameful, transient thing, destined to wash away. That's why I'm having them tear it down. What? I thought my beauty worth preserving too, but of course my worthless life will wash away as easily as any other. Almost. Little oh man. What the fuck is going on? Magista Tyrant of Slack Tide. I do not fear Dejashi, but I do fear Panda because he stole my lunch. <laughs> what do you mean? I never stole anything. I just happened to find that uh, lunch money in your pocket while <laughs> while I was shoving you in the locker. That's completely different. So like the earliest memories of your stream are Mario Maker and several honey, funny hack and slash games involving zombies. There was more than than one, but uh, one was kind of in them all. So like, oh really? Was I playing Dead Rising? <laughs> because the Mario Maker memories feel more distant. I'm gonna say yeah, Vango Raid. So like, yeah, probably that's where I remember you from, dude. I think. Uh, holy shit, who's that? Oh, that's. That's my mom right there. I disobeyed disobeyed her. Your death will be gorgeous. Oh fuck. Happy Mother's Day everybody. How do I activate? Oh yeah. Fuck. How worthless this all is! 
You said it was supposed to be like a dumb game. I mean, it is kind of a dumb game. I'm fighting a crab dressed like a queen and stuff like that. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think Einstein is looking at this and be like, I haven't thought about that. Like, you know. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so, hola, boyin. So, hell yeah, hell yeah. Look at this memory dog. So, like, yeah, that's one of my earliest clips, right? You know, let's. Let's watch this like banger again, dude. It's been a minute since it's benefits. Uh, <laughs> it's been a minute, dude. Holy shit. Uh oh yeah, and reminder everybody. So like this is a good reminder for me and to tell everybody. Um I don't know what the fuck I'm planning and stuff like that, but like uh when the hell was this clip from and stuff? Uh Avery clipped this dude it's four years ago, dude. That that's wild. That's been four years ago, dog. So like, oh, I, I muted it. This museum has its benefits, or used to working at a. That's a classic. Museum yeah, it's like a that. video game fight club classic, dude. So like, fucked it all up. <laughs> you see these boards right here? These boards are kind of cool because I can do something like this. I can do something like this, dude. Check this out. <laughs> Isn't that cool? I can write poop right here. I can write poop, mm. dude. Oh. <laughs> I still have those boards, dude. So like, I pulled them out like one time to to show uh, a bunch of people and stuff like that. But like, there's just no way of like really. Oh shit! I didn't mean to do that. Of staging them very well in like my new place and stuff like that. So like. <laughs> Uh, the other hack and slash you had like a mil military weapons or something so like military weapons or something I've returned and I immediately clicked on the link did I miss anything so like no we were just watching the link uh, the, the the clip and stuff as well just funny <laughs> but yeah, now that we watched that like um, that the throwback Thursday clip and stuff like that uh, it's time to announce that we've been um what affiliated with twitch for about four years now and stuff and twitch just sent me an email and stuff uh trying to remind uh, me and my viewers to celebrate like my uh whatchamacallit hold on wait let me, oh, fuck. Let, me let me see if i can find it and stuff dude oh like I'm looking through my Twitch, dude. So, like, hold on. Um. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Your stream anniversary is coming up. Hi, Pandorf. Congratulations. Today is just two weeks away from your affiliate stream anniversary. The day you became an affiliate, Twitch wants to get you in on a, on the fun. And help you celebrate this once in a year uh, milestone with your community. Oh shit! Oh shit! <laughs> oh man, hold on, let me just play this. Oh man. oh man, four years, yeah, four years, that's crazy, isn't it? There were tanks involved. Yeah, I think I was playing Dead Rising, dog. That was the same zombie game right there, dude. Four more years! <laughs> Four more years! Four more years! Front page! Yeah, I know. Right? Does this channel have something like a followage command? No, but I can tell you when you followed and stuff. Um, so, you've been following since August 28th, 2021. So, yeah, that's like almost three years ago, dude. That's, that's, that's wild. Dude, yeah, thank you so much for being here. So yeah, shout out to Senor Pollo too and stuff, so like, uh, <laughs> shout out to Twitch, no shout out to me, dude, so, so, yo, when did I follow, so like, yeah, 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 so, August 28th, 2021, so that's what it says right there when I click your account, 2021, yeah, that's a while, but anyways, let me continue reading this email, to help your audience support you and your anniversary when your viewers enter your channel, they'll see the parody head icon next to your name under the video player, as well as a private call out in chat prompting them to celebrate with a party hat emote so like really am i wearing a party hat like on my icon or whatever like that so like someone not on <laughs> someone not on mobile can 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 y'all confirm that or is it on mobile too as well so i'm not even sure so 
Uh, our research has shown that uh, this can lead to 5% increased chat activity and 20% more re uh, revenue during your stream anniversary broadcasts. We know sometimes your big day can fall on the wrong day. Birthday on a Monday, anyone? So, so feel free to choose a date any time within the next four weeks to host a special stream event. We wanted to give you lots of flexibility on rocking your party hat whenever is best for you. You don't have to do anything after picking your celebration day in your creator dashboard. Just go live and the features would automatically be available. Oh, okay, I think that's on like the day that I choose and stuff. And I already said May 22nd and stuff like that. So like, I don't know. We'll do a longer stream. I already promised Kirby that I was gonna play the classrooms or whatever like that. You know what else happens on May 22nd that I like realized and stuff? Uh, dude, Akuma comes on on Street Fighter 6. So I'm fucking, I'm fucking juiced. Follow Witch, I got you safe. I got you. Dude, you've been following since April 24th, 2020. Unfortunately, you didn't, <laughs> you didn't follow four days sooner. <laughs> <laughs> you know how much more funnier that would would have been if you if you would have just found my channel if i would have been playing mario 64 four days earlier on twitch you know <laughs> that would have been hilarious dude like fuck man <laughs> i'm on mobile it's not there i know i don't i don't think it's gonna be there i just i just realized um that's gonna be on like the 22nd or whatever you know so um so yeah that, that, yeah yeah so yeah can't have detroit and shit so like or can't have shit in detroit or i don't know <laughs> congratulations again on your upcoming stream anniversary if you have any questions check this neat nifty help article also if you have any feedback or ideas on special occasions and you'd like us to help you celebrate Please share them on your user voice. Happy partying! So like, man, man I, maybe I should submit some feedback to Twitch. Like, <laughs> give me 100% of the proceeds <laughs> from my, my, my subscriptions. Oh my God. No, that's never gonna happen. So like, motherfuckers took my toilet. Can't shit in Detroit. Oh fuck, I'm sorry, dog. So like, word, word. Well, I got a Home Depot bucket, you wanna borrow mines? <laughs> I sleep, homies, for sure. Thanks so much, Boyo, for being here and stuff. Uh, I'll see you around, take good care of yourself. Um, and yeah, man, thank you as, as always for being here and stuff. So like, yeah, so. <laughs> good night, Boyin. Oh, there's another one, dude. Hey, this song fucking slaps, dude. So like, oh, dude. <laughs> All right, we're gonna have to check this one out, so. This is when we played Mario 64, dude, like... That's funny. That's funny! That's funny! Oh my god. I just realized, dude. <laughs> my face is being blocked here, dude. Okay, we'll just watch it like this, so... My face is still being blocked. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. Hey, this song fucking slaps, dude, right here. <laughs> the ending theme? Bro, I fucking love this shit, dude. Dude, I think it was like hella fucking hey. hot that day, too, and stuff. We did it! Woo! Dude, my camera also looked like shit, too, back in the day and stuff, so like... <laughs> it's beautiful. Thank you for. Um, yeah, that was you, safe. You clipped this four years ago, too, as well. Holy shit. Damn, dude. Damn, dude. We should go back to, like, playing Mario 64, dude. Like. Yeah, Mario 64, the goat, dude. The goat, dude. <laughs> Anyways, uh, it's about to, no, it is already 11, dude. So like, god damn. Well, shit, then stop blocking your face. So like, no, dude, that's what I'm trying to do. All right, I'm going to do a couple tries right here for this boss fight. I'm going to call it a night and stuff. So, okay, do this. If you notice, but you
Oh. Looks like I already broke my shit. Yo, I'm going to sleep. Hey, no worries, dude. Thanks for being here. Oh, fuck. Damn it. Hit the hay even, so like, hell yeah, dude. Enjoy the hay and stuff. Retire for the night, perhaps. Like, after a whiling cro crocodile, am I right? What else? Um, hasta luego, muchacho. Hey, you, know <laughs> you can try this if you ever play it again, so like, what is this? Honk shoo shoo, honk shoo shoo, if you will. Wait, what? Oh wait, this is a short right here, so like, I can most likely do this. In Super Mario 64, there are fly guys who shoot fire. Notice how the fly guy changes size right before shooting the fire. Now, interestingly, we can interrupt the fly guy's fire shooting by moving out of his line of sight, which makes him turn towards Mario again and change size for one minute <laughs> So if we keep doing this, then the fly guy will end up shrinking and become very tiny. Oh In God. fact, we can keep shrinking him and he'll end up with a negative size, causing him to be upside down and inside out. And if we continue this, he'll just keep growing <laughs> negative size. Eventually, he grows so big that he's bigger than the course itself. But after growing him for just a few minutes, the game actually crashes. We can see why it crashes if we look at the map from the camera's perspective. On this map, I put a bounding square with radius 2 to the 15. The red area represents the base positions of the fly guy's body parts, sort of like a skeleton. But once the red goes outside the square, the game tries to convert too large a float value into a signed integer, and the game crashes. In Super Mario Bug. 64, <laughs> Notice how the fly guy changes We should definitely do that, dude. Right before shooting we... the fire. Now, interestingly, we no, can we can't. The that sucks. Fire shooting by moving that out sucks. Of the sight, which makes him turn towards Mario again. I remember seeing this video and stuff. Like, I thought it was interesting, so, but I'm hella down to do that. Like, just do some, like, oh. Holy shit. Just. Oh, fuck. Well, I died again. Well, what else would it, did I? What did I want to do with Mario 64? Like we can try speed running it. I don't know. Speed running is not like my my forte. You know. You know what we could do? We could also like play Mario hacks and stuff. Your forte is speedrunning games that haven't been speedrun before. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's how you know I'm a fucking guarantee record breaker, dude. <laughs> that's why, no, actually, I was gonna say that's why I'm gonna have a speedrun Bible, man. But no, there's actually people speedrunning that game, man. <laughs> I don't know if I have like the will to actually like <laughs> speed run that game. Slow run it, won't you, dude? Yeah, hell yeah. Oh my god. <clears throat> oh shit, did we forget our show?
I was gonna say, how am I not dead yet? <laughs> Guys, I have a new memory. <laughs> oh, thanks for the clip. Maybe it edited right on mobile, left my ass off. I'm no longer tired for some reason. So I... <laughs> what did you clip? Shoo-shoo, honk shoo if you will. Oh, that's a little funny, so like... <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, I'm dude, safe. I forgot. I kept meaning to like to fucking post that one clip you made about the Church of Edgar, dude. Because I just thought it was so funny. Your death will oh, be shit. gorgeous! Thank you for that clip, by the way. <laughs> Confuse himself. No, I did, dude. I have it on a on a notepad on my desktop to copy and paste. <laughs> oh my god, hell yeah, dude! Broke his own ankles without even going anywhere. Hey, I don't. Oh, Jesus Christ. Dude, I fucking dodged, dude. Okay, that one seemed to upset you because... And I retract. No, 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 it's not you, it's not you. Let's all ball our heads down for the reading of the official Pandar Floor Bible. So, like, ah, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna have to do it again, dude. I think I'm gonna have to do it again, dude. Uh, hold on. So, where is it? Alright, it's right here. It's right here. <laughs> oh, oh. oh, wait, what? Oh. oh shit, dude! Oh, wait, hold on. Hello. Test, test, test. Oh. Is this working? Oh yeah, there is a loop. Kinda. It keeps turning itself off and everything for some reason. I don't know why. Okay. Let me see. Let me try this again. In the Church of Edgar. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. In the Church of Edgar, followers of the Book of Mom 1, 
Something that is shared by all followers is that communion is shared by passing the chalice containing Belle Delphine's bathwater. Amen. <laughs> I did good, didn't I? Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, it is required that every priest go honk shoo at least one each sleep session. Oh, you guys want to know something really funny? <laughs> well, I was like trying to sleep um, yesterday and stuff. Uh, what? Are you fucking serious? I wasn't trying to fucking drop my shit, dude. And like, here's the game dropping shit. Ramen! <laughs> At this point, just get the Halo music. Left for myself. Also, funny ad. Bro is speaking and I'm hearing Seed Geek ads, so like, really? Cookie's back. Welcome back. Sorry, you, you missed communion and stuff like that. No, dude, but speaking of sleep, dude, yesterday, I don't know why, it's been like a common thing for me to just get home and take a nap because I'm just like pretty exhausted from work and stuff. And, um, I get home. I lay down and stuff, and uh, I'm like scrolling through like the internet on like my phone and stuff, dude. And like, I don't remember what the fuck I was doing. I, I guess I was like sleeping and stuff, but for some reason, I, I still, I still, <laughs> I, I, I still like, I was a little conscious and stuff, and I realized what I was doing and everything. So I, I, I just had my phone like this, and I was just like, like seriously i did that dude like I, I i tried to go sheesh while i was like sleeping and stuff but i was like sheesh, but like half asleep <laughs> and then i kind of woke up and i was just like what the fuck <laughs> oh my god dude i don't know i was just like oh fuck maybe i should just put my phone down and just actually take this nap and anything. I don't remember what I was watching on my phone. I was, yeah, it's true. I was there. <laughs> it was in the wall. <laughs> yeah, Neuron, all the Neuron heard was like, Shh. Like, <laughs> dude, like, it was, oh my God, dude. I, I was like, why am I doing this, dude? Like, you were alive, homie. We all heard. Oh no! <laughs> oh my god! What was I playing the other day? Where I, I I felt like I almost like fucking knocked out, dude. Like I was playing Kingdom Hearts too. Like yeah, this was like kind of recent too as well and everything. I guess I was just playing through a kind of a boring section in Kingdom Hearts and stuff. And dude, I shit you not, I was like my mind just turned off. But like I was like still playing video games and like I, so like I legit I was just like like this <laughs> and then I like <laughs> I, I swear to God I was just like dude I'm gonna just knock out in the middle of the stream right here. and dude I wasn't even <laughs> that streaming this late dude I think it was like ten o'clock or something like that dude but I was fucking tired dude oh. Oh my god we all heard it check the vods yeah dude check the vods dude rip where's the link to this funny dude like you just check the vods dude check the vods dog yeah. that's all all right i'm gonna do a few more tries with this queen and stuff but like honestly um like i'm kind of not feeling it and stuff i don't think we're gonna beat this like i'm just like whatever who cares you notice but oh. oh fuck you Feel oh mine. come on dude great yeah just fucking kill me Don't you see how worthless this all is Pass the controller, dog. So like, toma way, toma, toma way, toma way. Are you experienced with 
Souls likes games, dude. Safe is like, dude, I'm a fucking pro gamer, dog. Like, give me that shit, dude. You're so hey, bad I at video games. <laughs> Fucking dodge that shit. What the fuck? Can't you see how oh my god. This all is? Maybe Dark Souls games aren't for me, dude. Like, I don't know. You can't be a pro if you never beat Rugrats in Paris, dude. Like, damn, you're right. <laughs> What's harder? Beating, beat, breaking a record in Rugrats in Paris or this, dude? Like, I'm gonna say Rugrats in Paris. This is baby's work, dude. Hey, I don't the snail know beat the shit out of me. <laughs> nuts out there. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. You're oh, you know, this puta madre, dude. Like, oh. See how Fuck. worthless this all is! Rugrats in Paris, definitely. You at least someone enjoyed playing this crap game. Yeah, dude. <laughs> oh my god, dude. What do you mean? Rugrats in Paris is one of the greatest games ever made, dude. Like... <laughs> hey, I don't know if the you other know game took your entire to soul to get it through, so like... Oh, bro, you remember when I almost... Dude, do you remember when we almost beat that game? And then the game crashed on me, and I was just like, Fuck, dude, I'm playing Mario's JJ4! <laughs> I think it took me three fucking times to actually, like, speedrun that stupid game, dude. <laughs> I said I was gonna, like, retry my time, but, like, I never did. I was just like, nah, bro, fuck this. Your death will be gorgeous! Oh, bro. Your mind. Oh my fucking god, really? I don't know why that fucking pisses me off, dude. Like, like she throws her shit and then I dodge it. But somehow she still grabs me, dog. Hey, I don't know if you. Your death will be gorgeous. <laughs> Oh my god. Fuck the. Do you remember the levels where you had to be in like bumper cars and goo levels in the end of the Fuck those. <laughs> what, dude? Nah, bro. <laughs> that was one of the best sections in the game, dude. You don't. You don't like driving through like an un. Uh, like a really bad. <laughs> hey, I don't, know I don't if even you know what I'm saying. Yeah, dude, I... Oh, I sort of remember... 
Oh fuck. Your death will be gorgeous. What? See She's still fucking hit me, dude. Is. Oh my god. It was like the fucking sewer in there, and those unsupervised babies were drinking the film. <laughs> and they were having the time of their life, dude, okay? Bro, I wouldn't. I Don't yoke their yum, dude, okay? Excuse me. <laughs> hey, I Bruh. Your death will be gorgeous. Quit squirming. I'm See dead. I I got fucking orders. poisoned anyways. I just realized that. The time of their life, but they're at an age where they're not even gonna remember it. <laughs> See, that's I'm telling you, that's the best part of your life right there. When you can make all the mistakes in the world and you won't even remember any of them, dude, later on. No regrets, am I right, dude? <laughs> hey, I don't know what oh you my noticed, god. You know, if I was a baby, I would definitely would love to drink sewer, <laughs> sewer gunk, <laughs> just so I won't remember them the next day. You know. Can't you see how worthless this all is? That's what it is. Oh boy. Oh, dog, I said drink, not drink. <laughs> what do you mean, dude? <laughs> In my opinion, those babies were drinking and driving, okay? I'm telling you. Perfect age to be doing that sort of thing that you won't remember when you're an adult and stuff. Hey, I don't know if you noticed, but your guards are going nuts out there. <laughs> I didn't mean to just oh, say God. drink and drive. <laughs> oh, my God, dude. <laughs> Your death will be gorgeous! Your mind! Ah. Oh. 
Stop fucking barfing everywhere, dude. Let's try. Let's try. I'm. I'm. I'm kind of pretty much done with this game. You bitch. Can't you see how worthless this all is? God, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god. One last try. One last try. Dude, what the fuck, dog? Oh fuck, just kill me, dude. Like, honestly. <sighs> oh. 
Dude, oh. fucking lock on, dog. Can't you see how worthless this all is? Are you serious, man? Come on. Hey, Mr. M Dove, how are you doing? Just relaxing. That's the sub, dude. Yeah, I'm. I'm pretty much probably gonna end <laughs> about right now and stuff. I just need one more try. That's what I said like a while back ago. I understand, hey, though. So. Get her crown, you'll need to look fancy. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, dude. Oh. Are you fucking serious, dude? Oh, <sighs> fucking redo this, dude. I. Alright, officially I'm doing one more try. Hey, I don't know if you, you got this, I believe in you. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate the I'm fucking done, dude. Like, ah, uh. Anyways, moral of the story: fuck Microsoft. <laughs> moral of the story: fuck Microsoft, dude. <laughs> you know, fuck Microsoft for being a fucking conglomerate and stuff like that, and. 
Not believing in more, uh, oh shit. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. For not believing in smaller games and not just relying on fucking Call of Duty and Starfield and Halo and stuff, dude. So like, um, but yeah, so I, I'm done with this game for, for this week. We'll play it again next week. Um, we'll see how it goes. Uh, I'll see you around, uh, everybody. Well, I mean, you're not wrong there. So like, yeah. <laughs> It has nothing to do with the game, honestly. I'm just... Well, I mean, we're just playing this game off of Game Pass. That's why I'm kind of salty. <laughs> but anyways, thank you so much, everybody, for, like, hanging out and stuff. I really do appreciate the shit out of everybody. Uh, yeah, I'll be live tomorrow. We'll be playing this game called... Um, what was I going to say? Uh, oh, fuck. Dude, why am I forgetting it? And stuff like... Uh, I think Legends of Kinzera Zao and stuff. It's another Metroidvania. So this game might take another while and stuff. So have a good night, everybody. You be safe and take care. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Tales of Kinzera. No. Tales of Kinzera Zao. Hope your walls are nice and warm, dude. So like, I mean, yeah, you've been farting on them. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, man. Like you, you're on. You have a wonderful night. I hope uh, homework is going great and stuff and uh and yeah dude like yeah man we, we definitely need to get some chicken i get paid on wednesday so if you want to go on thursday let me know <laughs> but i know you're pretty busy with like school and stuff like that nowadays and everything so um but yeah no like i hope to get some chicken so but anyways thank you so much everybody i fucking love all of y'all and stuff thank you for watching me i'll see you next tomorrow for some tales of Zhao Kinzara. Uh, and yeah, deuces. Take care. I'll, I'll see you around. I'm not going to raid anybody. I, I don't feel like doing that. All right. Have a